I need an ambulance. Tell me exactly what happened. Um, my boyfriend, he's been asleep on the couch um, since this morning. Well, he never came to bed last night. Sleep on the couch. I left him on the couch before, before I took my son to school. To so it's pretty much a sad day in the city of Atlanta for the one and only rich homie Quan. Um, it was reported today that he passed away at age 34. Now, it got the city going crazy, mainly because I think people's thinking, oh, yeah, when Thug get out, Quan and Thug gone, you know, turn that music back up. But they never got a chance. And if you see this video of Thug in court, people starting to say that he got the news then and his whole face or mood changed. But y'all tell me how y'all feel about it in the comments down below. According to... Atlanta Rap News, it says, Rich Homer Quan was found unresponsive after being missing since 4 a.m. this morning. He was transported to Great Memorial Hospital around 9 a.m. when the medical staff worked on him for three hours before declaring him deceased. So, it's an R.I.P. to Rich Homer Quan. Now, a lot of people got the news and took it a certain kind of way, but for some reason, people really believe in that because his name was brought up in this case with Thug that pretty much stressed him out. I have an issue with Rich Homie Quan bringing members of If Gang to his apartment. So did you have an issue so what, with Rich Homie? I'm asking you for what you told the police. And I'm, and I'm asking Statements being said about him basically shooting up your dad's barbershop. Uh, what is a liar? <laughs> <laughs> the barbershop did get shot up, but it, it wasn't like... I don't want to talk about it, too, but it went like he is over exaggerated it because the same day the barbershop got shot up, it was back, it was up and running. <laughs> so it couldn't have been like what he said it was. So we're going to hold that down. Shout out to Woody. <laughs> That's the word. Y'all, what y'all think? People think it too deep. I think people really much think it too deep. But anyway, a lot of people took the social media, took the social media to, you know, give their condolence and shout out the corn. But little Woody did. Comment, he was like, I hate this happen. I pray that God protect Thug and them from this country. Um, Jaquees Quan, my brother, and he also said, My man, my brother Quan was one of them ones and responsible for so much. Ish, man, I love you, bro. Just talked to you and you told me how proud you was of me. I'm gonna miss you, bro, forever. I ain't cried in forever, bro. This one hurt for real. Two chain like dang little bro, we just spoke about shooting a video. Special prayers for you and your family, and pray for any and everybody that's dealing with something. My condolences, bro. Y'all let me know in the comments down below how y'all feel about this rich homie corn situation. Um, what y'all think really happened? I know everybody got their speculation that it was a bad pill, but y'all on conspiracy theory lap? Y'all think this got something to do with this trial? Let me know in the comments down below. But y'all know what I'm saying. Put the prayer and emojis down below. The rich homie corn. Right. Never got up. I don't feel a heartbeat. I don't see him breathing. And you said, hold on, you said on the couch and what happened? I said I put a cover over him because he gets a little cool. In the, he's in the living room. And now I just checked on him because I see he never got up. And I don't see him breathing. I don't feel a heartbeat.